Welcome to Vlogmas Day 3 and my own personal hell. This is breakfast. It is absolutely stunning. This is Steph's breakfast. Yeah. Absolutely stunning. <laughs> it's very snowy outside in case you're like, the fuck is that? It's shit. It's shit is what it is. Fucking shit. So I went outside and I already shoveled the front. <laughs> Gonna have to do the back. Going to do a little workout, gonna shower, and then Bronwyn's coming over and we're gonna watch Sherlock. So I wanted to talk a little bit about finances because I have been, I think for the last couple of years, really trying to work towards more of a minimalist lifestyle. And I did a no buy this year and I, I was pretty good. I was pretty steady until the no buy ended in September on my birthday. And I had all these grand, expectations of you know going back on the no buy for October and that just did not happen and I have gone crazy you guys with spending in the last little bit. Uh, Bronwyn went to her mom's real quick to shovel some snow there so we're taking a Sherlock break and I want to <laughs> I'm going to do a full video on my financial goals but I really, really need to, I think, start appreciating my stuff, oops, let's go that way, stuff that I have currently more, because I, I think it's okay that I have kind of like one time of the year where I spend a lot of money, because Black Friday, Cyber Monday, and Boxing Day, those are the best sales, and I should, if I need things, stock up then. If I need clothes, sure, stock up then. If I need makeup, sure, stock up then, but I take pretty much the entire like September to December as my go crazy buy whatever you want and that is not realistic and it's not something that I want to keep doing. For the next couple of weeks and especially entering into 2019 and for the duration of 2019 be incredibly conscious with my spending and that means I haven't really figured out all the details. I know I'm gonna try my best to do like a low buy Hopefully like a replacement only sort of situation where if I run out of foundation, which is unlikely I have like four full ones, then I can buy a new one. If I run out of powder, then I can buy one. I don't need 95 backups of something, especially because I just literally restocked everything. I just, I need to realize my goals are more important than having a new piece of makeup or something. And some of you guys have asked how I'm doing on my like financial goal of this house and because I said I want to pay off as much as I can but you can do 15% off the principal and I am a couple like thousand away from being able to do that. I'm quite close. I would say I'm like 80% there and I have some like end of the year payments coming in but I also need to think about taxes and then we're going to Vegas, me and my mom and my dad and my brother for my brother's 21st birthday which passed a couple days ago. So I'm putting aside some money for that. Then we're going to Mexico so I'm putting aside some money for that. Like I have these already pre-planned trips but I need to be smart with my money and not buy a bunch of unnecessary shit is essentially what I'm saying. So I really want to kind of hammer out some really good financial goals for 2019. Big thing right now is finish my degree. That is what I am absolutely so hardcore focused on. And if I'm done by May, I'm going to be overjoyed. And then after that, I want to again pay off as much of the house as I can because my end goal now, and I'm kind of in this with my parents at this point because they're selling their house and then they're going to be moving to Mexico for like six months out of the year and then when they're back here, they're camping for three months. So they really only need a place for three months out of a year. So they want to go in on a house with me that has kind of an income suite and then I, I would move into that house and probably also have a roommate and then I would rent out this house. So I think that that would be an amazing situation and something that I kind of want to look into doing more of is like buying places, having renters in. And I've always loved the idea of like flipping houses and we've made so many improvements to this one and it's nice having like handy family members where you can like raise the value of a house and anyways, I'm really interested in doing something like that and I think that this is a really easy way to kind of like dip your toes in the waters, like fix up a house, see what it's worth to rent out and but okay, I'm getting so ahead of myself. I just want to talk about goals. So I want to be able to save up to pay off as much of this house and then I want to be able to save up and put like some of a down payment onto another house and like I have all these 
goals of grandeur and it's gonna take a lot of hard work and a lot of like being very strict with myself I feel like I lost that a lot through like Christmas madness and oh my god this person would love this as a gift and blah 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 I'm really inspired to save like a buttload of money and I'm also really inspired to finish my degree so I can work literally twice as much on YouTube. Like I am so excited to raise up my upload schedule again. Doing Vlogmas has really like every year it just kickstarts my inspiration for YouTube and it makes me so like creatively inspired and after my uh, final is done, my last one I think is on the 13th, I should know. <laughs> do I? No. I think it's on the 13th. Um, I want to do a ton of like crazy fun videos on here like those truth or drink and like just challenge videos so let me know if there's anything specific you want to see here. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking about all this stuff, but I would love to know what your goals are for even the remainder of this year and then for the new year. We're going to the basement to clean it up. We're going to the Thrilling. Chamber. The torture chamber! Ooh, you guys get to see the cat room and all of its cat-filled glory. Here is Steph's Christmas set. It's so cute. It is so cute. Let me get it like straight on so it's not just... Wait, but I want to put the lights on. Beautiful. So this is why we can't decorate for Christmas yet because her minis are still going on until tomorrow. And here's the room that we're trying to work on a little bit. Disaster. It's such a fucking mess. So this is all of Steph's stuff. Steph's stuff. Uh, Steph's stuff. Okay, Look, some Steph's stuff. Look at some Steph stuff. Look at some Steph stuff. It looks seriously so much better. We vacuumed, guarded two garbage bags of stuff. Like, hi, amazing put a lot of it in here but that's fine and then behind the door looks so much better I don't think I showed you back here before but we can open the door all the way there's one of the bags of garbage stuff that we're bringing upstairs my room's clean your room is so clean um as soon as the landing's done I'll vacuum just right here too 